Take your belongings off my ship first. Hope I never have to use it. But something tells me. Trust a tourist advertisement. Now get out! At last, Mr. Ch nice to meet you. Johannes Vanderberg, at your service. I did promise to meet you the moment you arrived. Ah, much obliged, Mr. Vanderberg. I guess I didn't expect you to mean so literally. Please call me Johannes. But where are my manners? Welcome to the proud city of Oakmont. Reaching Oakmont was no easy task. Oakmont is no ordinary place. It's unique geographical, but you... Tell me about this flood. It began six months ago. Now the city is cut off from the mainland. You said you know someone who can help me with my... Problem. He has dedicated a lot of time and effort to investigate this issue. How can I find Mr. Throgmorton? Don't worry, you can't miss him. Throgmorton tends to... <laughs> stand out from the crowd. Can you tell me a little about Mr. Throgmorton? A remarkable creature. Scion of a robust bloodline. A philanthropist, a man of great ambitions, and even greater ego. Do not make him wait. I'll need a place to lay my head while I'm here. Fair enough. I've already feathered a nest for you. There's a room in your name at the Devil's Reef Hotel. Here's the key. Sounds... charming. Don't judge a book by its cover, Mr. Reed. What's the best way to get around Oakmont? And like most locals go by foot, or by boat. I've got the latter sorted for you. There's one waiting outside the port. Uh, you too. Take this map. I've marked the hotel and a few other... Oh, but... No, no. Oh. Don't...
I don't care about your petty excuses. No one leaves the port until my son is found, and that is final. Uh, <clears throat> uh, excuse me. Are you Robert Throgmorton? I am, but not interested. Go away. The name's Charles Reed. I'm a private investigator, just arrived from Boston. I was told you might be able to help me. Private investigator, you say? Well, perhaps we can help each other. Please forgive the question, but I've never met a man quite like you before. That's because no man measures up to the Throgmorton lineage. Proud and powerful blood flows through our veins. My father united with a certain royal family, which has blessed all our offspring with these exquisite features. If I may ask, what happened to your son? Why do you care? What's your angle, outsider? Well, like I said, I'm a P.I. Finding people is kind of my specialty. Is it? Well, Albert was part of a deep-sea expedition I commissioned. This useless fool over here says he found Albert washed ashore in a lifeboat. Says he was barely conscious, out of his mind, talking gibberish in some other language. But he even tried to bite him. And you don't believe him? Complete malarkey. I know my Albert. I raised him strong and smart, the best of his kind. Albert's disappearance is the work of Innsmouthers, mark my words. I've heard you're the man to speak to about visions, outbreaks of hysteria. Another newcomer with another problem. <laughs> yes, I know what you speak of. Can I ask you a few questions? How dare you. My son Albert is missing, and no one in this Innsmouth or ridden city will do a damn thing. But yes, let's talk about your dreams. I take it you're not the biggest fan of these in- Those fish-faced freaks have overrun this city since the police burned Innsmouth to the ground. But now, those filthy migrants occupy half this damn city. So they're just... refugees? <laughs> Hardly. They've taken work from the local fishermen. They stir and agitate against us. Both not to mention that crime rates have skyrocketed. Simply speaking, they are a big stinking pile of trouble. Mr. Throgmorton, let me help you. What makes you think you can do it? Let's just say I tend to see things that others miss. Vera, you have a point, newcomer. Sorry, did you just say Vera? What does that mean? You had better get used to the Oakmont dialect, outsider. That is, if you want to fit in. It is a fascinating blend. I see. I need to know more about what happened to Albert. Tane, did you not listen at all? I already told you everything. After leaving on the expedition, Albert was found on the shore in a lifeboat. This fisherman supposedly brought him to the house, and then left to call me. Anything else? Clearly, something suspicious occurred inside the house. I suggest you stop dawdling and go see for yourself. Where's the house where this all happened? For Kay's sake, I thought you were a private eye. We're standing right in front of it. As much as I'm enjoying the weather, Mr. Throckmorton, it's time for me to get started. Find my son, newcomer, and be quick about it.
Let's see what you find, newcomer. Hello? Hey, can you hear me? <sighs> oh, my head. It's okay. I'm Charles Reed, Private Eye. Mr. Throgmorton hired me to find his son. Oh, oh okay. I want to know what happened here. Every detail. I don't remember much. Me, Paul, and Lewis. Then he came back carrying Throgmorton's son. He was unconscious. Then what? We put the guy in Lewis's room. And he woke up. And after that, I don't remember a thing. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Tell me about yourself. Uh, name's Will. Will Hammond. I'm a fisherman. We all are. Live here. We moved here after the flood. Who is this K you keep mentioning? Outsider, show some respect. K is our lord, our light, our love. Sorry, I didn't know. Where are all the other guys? Uh, that's Paul there on the floor. K be with him. Barry's outside with Mr. Throgmorton. Lucky rascal missed everything. And I have no idea where Lewis or Throgmorton's son got to. Do you know how Paul died? I don't know. When I pulled myself together, he was already... I'll leave you to it. Take care of yourself, Will. Please, Detective. Sir, tell me the truth. Could it be me? Did I kill Paul? Or... I don't know yet, Will. The police will stop anyone coming in or out of here, so I suggest you just try and get some rest. I'm afraid of what I might dream. Choo choo. Ahem. <clears throat> choo choo. Ahem. <clears throat> choo choo. Ahem. <clears throat> I can barely recognize the face of the poor fella. He was beaten to a pulp. Recognize the face of the poor fella. He was beaten to a pulp. The book is damp and damaged, but clearly well cared for. I've said everything I know. Don't do anything stupid, newcomer. And keep your hands where I can see them. Closed by order of Robert Throgmorton. Back off. The port is closed by order of Robert Throgmorton. Back off. <laughs> 